in a home or an apartment are actually the toughest. Hanging one photo could be tough. But when the wife goes, I would like you to put the photos up the stairwell like I see on TV. Yes. It, it's, it's a nightmare. You draw lines, you drill holes that didn't need to be drilled. All of those things that you want to hang on a wall take some pretty sophisticated mathematics to be able to get them up and make it right. This is called Easy Hanger. It took all the math out of it. In fact, you don't need a tape measure. You need just one thing, a pencil and maybe a hammer and a nail. That's yeah. basically all. All right, man, this is Sean Pickford. Good, good. Uh, if you're gonna hang multiple things, if they're off, Everybody's I, everybody steps it. back, and that doesn't tell you if it's level or not. You've got plumb, level, and square. Yes. This can do all three, and it does it with no additional tools. That's the great thing about the Easy Hanger, because you know what? When you go to put these things up, it takes all the frustration out of it. I had to put in four different screws to get these boxes up here. I had to make sure that they were the right distance apart for this box here, because uh -huh. this box here is it. And on I, the back of that box, if yeah. I don't get them within an eighth of an inch where those little markers are, it doesn't four, work. Get it. Not only that, they and your be wife level. wants them to be level. <laughs> so how are you supposed to do all of that? Well, it's really simple, real easy. And we'll show you with the big picture. See this guy here? Yep. This requires two screws in the wall. That, to most people, is a lot of chance to make a whole lot of mistakes. <laughs> Not with easy hanger. And here's the deal. Sean and I have known each other long enough. Listen, if there is any chance at all that we could screw it up. We will. We are screwing it up. Right. So watch how this tool works and show them what makes it different. You and I launched, it was a smaller version of this tool about 10 right. years ago. Right. And we had talked, went back to the manufacturer and said, you know what, I'd really love to have an even larger unit. So they've got it now, this is 36 inches, it's got bubble levels and there are three of them. Right. A bubble level will never, ever, ever lie to you. No, because here's what we're talking about, here's the D-rings, this is where we have to put the screws in, right. so these guys can hook onto the wall so the mirror's straight and level. Okay. All I did was took this and I slid it out. It, it goes from two feet to three feet, and there's slides, so this slide here, okay. this slide here, this slide here. I don't even have to measure this. I don't care how far apart it is. Just put one on top and one right here, in the center. One here. Okay. Now, I take this and I transfer it over to the wall, Come which here. we would do over here. So when I put that up on the wall there, I would mark it. Little pen right. mark there. I would mark this guy here. All right, and then we would look over there, and since we already got this one up, you can see on your bubble. The bubble never lies. It tells you, are we level? It's level. We're level, all right? So we just made two marks on the wall, uh -huh. put two screws in the wall, and we took all the frustration out of it that fast. And the best part is, before this, uh, I've got a lot of photos. I mean, hundreds of photos. Looked like it was in a gunfight your wall, didn't it? <laughs> yes. Because yes. there's holes everywhere. <laughs> Everybody goes through that. Uh, yes, it is so much simpler, and it doesn't matter what mechanism is being used to put whatever you're hanging on the wall on the wall. Right. So it doesn't matter whether it's a sawtooth hanger like I've got here, whether it's heavyweight clips, D -rings, whether it's whether the it's... interiors like this, it just doesn't matter. The videotape will show some of it. Right, the next one you're gonna see here, this one's a nice shelf system, all right? Yes, and this it's called won't... an invisible <laughs> yeah. support system, which the problem with that is it's almost impossible to get it right. When you use the easy hanger, you can't get it wrong. And there you're seeing it, he put it up that fast, whether yep. it's that invisible shelf that you have there, whether it's a large mirror, Mark any it. things like that. That's all you have to do is, it's perfectly marked, perfectly level every single time. There's four chances to make a mistake because you have to put four screws yep. in the wall. They can't be cattywampus or else now, it doesn't go up. It also drew exactly in the middle uh -huh. of the picture. Because you don't want the picture to be hanging over this stair uh -huh. tread because it doesn't look right then. So this takes all the frustration out of your home projects. I just hung kitchen cabinets in my mountain house this past weekend. Fun! Those walls were the most warped walls I've ever yes. seen. The place is 40-some years old, so I knew that going in. I used my easy hanger. Uh -huh. My cabinets are dead on perfect. And, it, it's, and my dad was impressed, and he's 85 years old. He goes, where can I get one of them? That's, it really is a spectacular tool. I, I have the original, which is smaller. This one, we just started being able to make available. It's a larger unit. And, and I'll, I'll be the first one to tell you, I don't use it every day. I, I haven't used mine in probably three months. But when you need but it? But when I need it, it is the go-to yes. tool for hanging photos. I have a photo collage 
of about 120 photos in my office at home. Back in my days when I was, you know, doing stand-up and working with, you know, Robin Williams and the rest of it, those are prized possessions. But yeah. to try to get that many photos so they were all exactly where I, it took me two weeks when we moved into the house to get those photos up, and, just and I to, butchered the wall. And people, they measure down from the ceiling or up from the floor. They're, They're never, never square. Level. They're yep. never square. This is easier. This does it. There's that shadow box, that shelf that you were talking about before. You can see these are recessed. All right, I can't be off by an eighth of an inch. If I am, there's no way this is going to go And you're going to wind up with another hole in the... And the great thing is, is I'm not measuring it. I don't need to know. All I do is I take this, and you can see through it. There's a right. hole in there. So I line that guy up here. I take this slide over to here. I line this one up here. Now, we take this... And by the way, it's got Imperial, transfer... which is regular English, right. and then it also has metric. Right, and we transfer it over to the wall. So then I would take my pen, got and it. I would mark it here. I would there. mark it there where the holes are. Now, let's take this one a step further. Your wife says, that's great, but I want one above it and one below it. Row, row. No. Okay. The easy hanger's so much easier. All you All do. Right. So we're going to go ahead and we'll set this guy to zero. How far do you want them apart, sweetheart? We want this, oh, say seven inches. We'll okay. do this, we'll do this, we'll line this guy up here. You know this mark is right and you know this mark is right. Because the bubble level never right. lies. So we would take this guy to the wall, yep. put this here, we would mark this one on the wall, Got and that one, one on the here, wall. But this one here. This bubble here gives me plumb. That All tells right? us if you're plumb and level. And I would do it and over here. do it on the other side. Here. How fast is that? There. And now we've got all three shelves three up, and it shelves. took about two minutes to do. And that's how simple and how easy this is, because it's taken it's the so two. so good. Yeah, because, I mean, before it was a and tape the, measure. And by the way, I was really impressed with the instructions and how easily they, they help you to understand this. I would sit down with a calculator and a pad of paper and try to figure to it out. try to measure all this stuff out, and I would still absolutely butcher it. And that great thing and is, I'm pretty is good with this stuff. The, the bubble never lies. Yep. It shows you step-by-step -step instructions how to use it. There's a little button on the end that allows it to telescope in and out. We've seen some people that say, oh, I've had a hard time getting in and out. Just press that button in. Even if you got to put it down on the table to press the button in, go ahead and pull it back up. Yep. It's very simple, very easy to do. anything to hang in your home, that $19.92 that you invested on the Easy Hanger will make your life easier. We've had over 1,000 ordered. Over 300 of you on the phone lines. I've never found anything that makes it easier than this. I mean, you this. can use it for leveling. I mean, you can use it to build a deck. I hung right. kitchen cabinets with it. I mean, we, I had to get level and plumb and everything else. And like I said, my dad's 85 years old. He's got every tool known yeah, to man. Yeah, your dad's hard to impress. Where can I get one of those? Like my dad. <laughs>